very important uh, segment of this inaugural session is a Lifetime Achievement Award. IPTA launched Lifetime Achievement Award a few years back. And then as we progress, we have refined it. Currently, we are giving award, Lifetime Achievement Award in four categories. One, a professional, somebody who has been associated in managing the mill. Number two, entrepreneur, somebody who has put up an industry and has scaled it up, done wonders. Number three is all the technology that comes to us in India, I would not, we don't call them a supplier, they are the technology provider. And fourth pillar is research, development, and academic. So we have professional, entrepreneur, technology provider, research and development. On these four pillars, we are having today Dr. A.R.K. Rao, the professional. Please come over with your family, friends to the dais. Please come to that side. Wait, wait, ma'am. Hold on, hold on. Dr. Rao is a bachelor in technology in chemical engineering from Osmania University, Hyderabad. He has published over 45 papers and reviews. Served in various paper mill, Mysore, Sashashai, Andhra Pradesh, Sipri. Doc Sab, I'll request you, let me have the pleasure of telling you all about you. And he was the chairman of Hindustan Paper Corporation. He has received several awards from Government of India and various institutions from India and abroad. Retained as technical advisor by Sashtai Paper and Board Mills, Sri Shakti Paper, served as director acting Central Pulp and Paper Research Institute and Best Paper Award winner for four years from Indian Pulp and Paper Technical Association. Please, Dr. Sir, please come here. I'll request Mr. Jay Shanjan to come forward. Hold on, man. Sir. Dr. Sir, please come. Miss, please, family members also, please come forward. Please. Dr. Sir. Please join us. Can we have a good photograph, Dr. Sir? Dr. Sir? With all the family members and friends, let them come in front. Please come in front. Who is she? Who is she? Oh, oh, please come forward. Saji, please come this way. Doctor, would you like to say a few words? Okay, please come over. Doctor, be, be, be brief, okay? Be brief, please. Okay. <laughs> Mr. Jayesh Ranjan would like to be excused, so we'll continue in a moment, please. Thank you, Mr. Goel. I wish you a very good morning to all of you. I consider receiving this Lifetime Achievement Award from IPTA as the highest honor bestowed on me in my life. I thank IPTA Executive Committee, especially President Sri Ganesh Bhakti, Vice President Pavan Khaitan, and Secretary General Mr. M.K. Goyal, and especially Nomination Committee for choosing me to give this award. My association with IPTA has been for the 50 years, last 50 years, since 1973. And during this period, I had a pleasant privilege of participating in various activities of IPTA. All managements who employed me 
were very kind to sponsor me to many IFTA seminars as well as meetings and allowed me to take part in IFTA. Now, I had various opportunities to learn pulp and paper technology in, while working in IFTA by meeting and interacting with real stalwarts in paper industry like all late Sri Roshanlal Bhargava, Sri Ravindranathan, Sri V.P. Gohel, Sri B.L. Bihani, N.S. Sadavarte, Dr. N.D. Misra, Dr. N.J. Rao, Dr. A.K. Prasad, like that there were so many of them. And I really got benefited by interacting with all of them. I owe my career in paper industry to late Dr. Roshanlal Bhargava, who was then the general manager of APPM as well as West Coast Paper Mills, uh, by allowing me an entry into Andhra Pradesh Paper Mills in 1973. And this gave me advantage and opportunity to learn basics and running a paper industry. In 1977, I got selected to work as the project coordinator for the United Nations Development, FAO and GOA project, exploration and identification of alternative raw materials for paper and newsprint manufacture. This position enabled me to get an excellent exposure to international paper industry as well as their technology. The great privilege to have worked with Dr. John Fellegi, a highly knowledgeable and fully devoted project manager from Fruit and Agriculture Organization of United Nations. These facilities created under this project formed the nucleus for setting up the Central Pulp and Paper Institute, which is now serving the Indian paper industry very, very, very satisfactorily. In 1981, I got a lucky break to start working in Sashai Paper and Boards, which is an excellently managed professional company established by the great industrialist Sri S. Viswanathan. SPB has an abundant knowledge in pulp and paper making from forest-based raw materials as well as bagasse. During my service of nearly 12 years, I could learn a lot of technology working with namely late Sri N. Ravindranathan, late Sri S. G. Rangan, present chairman Sri N. Gopal Ratnam, and present MD Sri Kas Kasi Viswanathan. And this experience helped me to run Mysore Paper Mills as well as Hindustan Paper Corporation reasonably satisfactorily and achieve record productions. On retirement from HPC, I could contribute my knowledge to set up a banknote paper mill in Mysore for Reserve Bank of India to manufacture paper to print currency. It is very gratifying that this is working extremely well and producing paper more than 25 percent within three years than established capacity. Now, it gave me an immense satisfaction to have worked on this because it is serving a national need. Now, continuing to be as a technical advisor to SPB and on the panel of judges of CII, that is Confederation of Indian Industry, gave me good opportunity to keep my knowledge afresh with the latest developments in paper industry. And I owe a great deal and thank these two organizations. And I thank all of you for your patient listening. Thank you.